Ever at this cottage. I'm the sole breadwinner in this family. <laughs> drink, 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 donate. E beggar. Drink, booze, hound. Drink, 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 donate. E beggar. Drink, booze, hound. Drink, 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 donate. E beggar. Drink, uh, happy birthday, booze, hound. Hack e beggar. Uh, I'm going to ride this uh, YouTube gravy train until the wheels fall off. Uh, donate e beggar. Donate e beggar. Donate e beggar. Gravy train. I'm not Muslim. Uh, I'm just a food channel that's running out of ideas. In the meantime, let's watch some TikTok. I'm a TikTok white Canadian. I'm a TikTok white. I'm a TikTok white Canadian. I'm a TikTok white. I'm not Muslim. Uh, I'm just a white Canadian white guy. Hitler flap. Thank you very much. White guy. Because I'm white. So the Japanese are horrible people. If I had a gun and you were right in front of me, I'd put the gun to your face. Ah. 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 Uh, I'm gonna ride this uh, YouTube gravy train until the wheels fall off. Uh, I think I've stalled. <laughs> <laughs> If I had a gun and you were right in front of me, I'd put the gun to your face. Bitch. Uh, I did the uncut raw videos. Whether we win or lose, we drink booze. Salute a British, a British, a British peanut. <laughs> I have zero knowledge. I'm very uneducated. Is this your full-time job? Yes. This is a business. Topper's Pizza. This is a business. Topper's Pizza. Hmm. Uh huh. That sucked like shit. That sucked huge fucking shit. Do you enjoy doing food reviews as much or are you bored? I'm bored. I only promote things that I like. The Jackery, the Jackery, the Jackery, the Jackery, the Jackery. My Jackery, the Jackery, the Jackery, Jackery, the Jackery, the Jackery, the Jackery, the Jackery, the Jackery's working its butt off. Blue Eddie, this thing is absolutely amazing. Call me a, a sellout. Screw off. Tangy. Mmm. Tangy. Mmm. Tangy. 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 I'm insane. Double, a double. Hi, can I get a medium Pepsi, please? Sorry? Medium Pepsi. There's a sign. There's a sign. There's a sign here saying turtles. Oh. Oh. Yep. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> this is my car. <laughs> We're gonna do it. Here we go. Ready? Oh no. Mmm. <laughs> mm. It's totally messy, but yeah. the idea is you keep it in the wrapper. I know, I know. I want people okay, to okay, see okay. it. But he wanted to eat this in the car. So I think we could have, no? Mm -hmm. Would have rocked my car. Mm. I'm not Muslim. Uh, I'm just a white Canadian Hitler flap. See what I mean? Hitler flap. Thank you very much. Because I'm white. The Chinese are horrible, so the Japanese are horrible people. Fuck. Fuck. Shit. Beautiful, 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 beautiful looking lunch. You are good at describing food. You really gotta stop that. You really need to stop that. Oh, how else to fix this? You really gotta stop that. You really need to stop that. <laughs> This is the dumpster that we, your mom and I found you in. Your real name was going to be called Waste Management. 
I think I made more fucking money than you ever did. Uh, then we did the oil lube and filter thing and uh, the filter was $11 and the synthetic oil change was uh, $13.25 per liter I guess or whatever and then so $79.50 so we got the $59.95 the $11 the $79.50 page two it's a book Here's Steve Wallace. Everybody loves this guy. He's a really nice guy. He's a real stealth van life camper guy. Everything he does is legit. Look at all of his thumbnails. You see the graphic design? White block Helvetica bold on top of a picture. And here's Ken, right? You see the upper left in the middle? There, okay, so there's his ripoff uh, logo. And here he is totally ripping off Steve Wallace's graphic design. Make off, sure you talk when you run the camera. Put your fucking hands on the fucking wheel. You don't care about others. Uh, this is a character line. study. Now, if you're a child, don't fucking watch this. Tuesday morning footage. I forgot to show you. Thanks, Ken. We're so glad you just didn't delete this. Footage of all the bric-a-brac in your ugly shack in the old village backyard. Thanks for sharing. I mean, could you imagine him not sharing that? What we have here is a branded garbage mug from Jelly Smack in the Captain America cup. Uh, which you've all seen. Oh, yeah. Um, showing the clutter on your kitchen counter. Jelly Smack. Go bigger. I just had to show you this. How pathetic. There is no other word for it. If you get excited or impressed by this, the same shtick he does with the cat all the time. Okay, Ken, enough. How amazing, the shack in the elf village. Walking on your ugly backyard, jelly snack, go bigger. <laughs> Now, do you have a sense of satisfaction when he powers up his vehicles? I don't. Come on, Ken, move, 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 move! Oh my gosh. Yeah, look at how cramped it is. Stuffed to the gills with vehicles. Shooting footage of your dashboard. Jelly smack. Go bigger. <laughs> okay, come on. Come on! Hurry up! Now the music doesn't fit here, okay? Like, he's got terrible choices for music. Oh, no, now we're back up to speed. It's Wednesday morning. And, and now we got the most current footage from Ken. How amazing. The same bric-a-brac. Uh, it's, it's, can you imagine what the neighbors think? They look across the street and he, like he's shooting footage of his bric-a-brac. Look at my bric-a-brac. Wow. Okay, so I, I changed the music. Just to show you that Ken's choices in music are so bad and inappropriate, you might as well just run whatever you want. So here. And then this sort of took on a life of its own. There's Miss Millions. There's the boss. Ken gives us everything we need. She's the boss. She's got the millions. Get out of the house, Ken.
If I had to bear Or if I had to bleed If I got to fail Or if Don't I it. had to bleed Don't it. Don't If it. I Don't tell it. a Or if I speak the truth Carol's family. We can't say that when we're live. <laughs> Don't say it at all. It's none of their business. It's none of their business. <laughs> Told you it kind of did its own thing there. All right, how are hey, you doing? Hey, Turtle. How's it going? Here to pick up the prop, Mobile. Rusty. Rusty's dirty, Rusty. He's appealing to some sort of audience out there that, 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 that is, you know, this is like almost a children's show. Rusty, dirty, Rusty. Rusty, dirty. <laughs> like, who, who's going to take that seriously? Could you imagine Dame or JP sitting around watching this? Dirty, rusty, rusty, fat, dirty, rusty, rusty, dirty. Here's some more great content from Ken Donick. He publishes this. He considers this to be content. It's from KBD Productions TV, ladies and gentlemen. All right, guys. Are you ready for the big damage report? Yeah, as if it's our problem. Actually, it's it, it, it's the responsibility of his audience. Remember, he needs support. And like, oh, I had to spend all this money. Oh, here comes the big damage report. It was a big damage report. Let me tell you. Yeah, that's so, the only big damage around there. Your beer gut. Uh, I don't. I don't want to tell you the full bill. Oh, okay, right Ken. Again. As if it's okay. So you know, as if we, we have to. We you know, he does. He expects it's 59 our responsibility. Look at my expenses here. I need, need support. I need support. Look at all the money that's been spent. I need. He said, if it needs it, do it, which was something a grandpa would say. I said, if it needs it, do it. Uh, I talked I'm, over my own I'm line. Move the tires off this car since I put the brand new tires on this car. So they Yeah, whatever, Ken. So he said there, oh, if it needs uh, it, do it. So I was, uh, uh, um, this is like guy, one so take. I don't know where to move a tire if one tire is getting worn over another one. Uh, the only the only one we had was when we had the ball 
the ball joint was broken and it was making my remember my windshield my uh, windshield my steering wheel was vibrating. So even though I did a I bunch of work, it was in alignment, but it wasn't alignment. It's still like a freestyle, so I'm not going back. The tires, because it was forcing the tire to do something weird, and uh, I ignored it for too long, and, and it cost a lot of money to fix it. Plus, it killed the tire. So uh, I have one brand new tire on this vehicle. So hopefully, they did a good job at rotating the tires. Uh, then we did the oil. Lube I just can't believe he's got no and, class to uh, the sit there. Was $11. And you know, you know what this is and for? It's for his audience, okay? It's not for us. This is for uh, his audience of idiots that actually thinks he needs money. Per liter, I guess, or whatever. And then like, there's no entertainment in this at all. It's like three pages of what it took to keep the prop vehicle on the road, which he selected a used heap on purpose. It's a book. And here comes the brakes part. Yeah, look so at all the trouble I'm in. Here comes a, the brakes uh, now. A brake fluid flush. Uh, I think they said the brake fluid was, I don't know. They, they recommended getting the brake fluid flush. I'm sure a bunch of you would be like, don't ever do that. But we did it. We want it to be safe. Yeah, and you got the uh, money to so burn on it. $25 you don't need any help. Plus, you're writing it off anyway. $3. That the prop vehicle is meant to make him look that. poor. <laughs> struggling. The right, two hundred twenty-six dollars. This reaction is going to get better, okay? Uh, I just want to document that he actually has the gall the to sit there and rattle off all of the expenses. Replaced, it's not for entertainment. It's to keep guess, his idiots know, giving him money. Uh, so just remember that. That's what we're documenting here. Five hundred and ninety-nine dollars and eighty cents. Um. And then there is a core charge for $63. It is meant to look, make, it's, Page three. it is done to, to make so him look like, like said, he needs, I, I needs help would be around with money. $700. So if I had just got these brakes on, I'm thinking it'd be five ninety nine eighty. But then we have He is not the type of person who would listen to you if you had to tell him, oh, I had to fix my car. Oh, I had to fix the house. Um, he wouldn't care. Um, Okay, so all the labor this that is, they did This is only for his idiots, right? That's why it's there. And nine dollars for a grand total of fifteen hundred and nine dollars. Yeah, you don't have to worry about That's it. You just bought a seven hundred dollar Apple Watch. You don't here, need. The labor was six hundred and ninety. And after this, he left for another vacation of ten days. And a vacation from being on vacation. For a total of seventeen oh one, and then our taxes was two hundred and twenty one. Disgusting. For a grand freaking total of nineteen hundred and twenty two forty one. Wow. Okay, I, I, I'm pretty sure I left myself a minute here. Um, that that was all to uh, appeal to his audience, who they think he, he's struggling. His story is this. You, you know, like, when, when Carol's father sold a giant cottage with a huge property uh, shortly after Carol's mother... I know there's a few people that said, just put the money into uh, Moose. Oh, again, never mind. I'll just keep talking. After Carol's mother had, had passed, Moose is not a um, camper, and a lot Carol, of people love my stuff. That giant stuff, cottage was sold, and then Carol retired. As long as I possibly she gets can. half of that. So thanks to you guys for watching my 24-hour stealth camps, at uh, especially in, in the last two months. So um, what did we do? We did five guys. This is still going uh, to get better, okay? IHOP, Cracker Barrel. If it was this bad all the way that, through, did, I wouldn't have Waffle made this. House, so It'll all get these better. things, they all made really good revenue, which is helping me absorb this cost. Plus, again, all my channel members and my Patreon main members. Okay, maybe I, I meant to do it here. It's like, this is... Okay, not this one. All right, this is Ken ripping off the, the, the graphic design of van life, right? This is what a hack does. So, oh, this is some money in that. So first he rips that off. Next, come on, next, next, please, next. Okay. Here's Steve Wallace. Everybody loves this guy. He's a really nice guy. He's a real stealth van life camper guy. Everything he does is legit. Look at all of his thumbnails. You see the graphic design? White block Helvetica bold on top of a picture. And here's Ken, right? You see the upper left in the middle? There, okay, so there's his ripoff uh, logo. And here he is totally ripping off Steve Wallace's graphic design. So people will hit that. And make a mistake and think that Steve Wallace did it. What a fucking hack. What a ripoff. What a shitty excuse for a creator. Get the fuck out of here. You hack. 
Go make cat videos again. Get out you of here. You guys are all amazing, and it helps me keep this vehicle on the road. And again, I need this vehicle on the road to make that content. The Sprinter van is mainly for camping with Carol. So this last solo camp, whenever I do anything by myself, mainly it's gonna be in this one. I, I, I definitely wanna do a solo camp with Rusty and just do something that Carol might not wanna do. I'll try and figure that out. But when there's things that uh, I want Carol to join me in, we'll be using the Sprinter van and going on adventures together with the Sprinter van because it's kind of designed, we made it so that Carol and I could do things together. So Designed? Again, I need they Rusty to that do thing. my stealth camping and my solo trips and my solo camp and my soul it was a failure his own audience rejected it kick your fucking hands back on the wheel what a fucking irresponsible goof man he's like this like in, in his own off-camera life too like like, it, like he doesn't so care about I others this vehicle on the road and when i get a bill like that i have to pay it i like i need like he wants his idiots to feel thought. sorry for him so i have to make that decision and i would say by the end of January, the stop playing to the camera. We'll make, we'll pay back. Like, that look at him talk about money like he's in trouble. And for sure, it would have been. He's, he's keeping this up. I'm barely getting by. Windows in Moose, but like I said, I need to keep this vehicle on the road too. So keep your fucking hands on the wheel, you fucking piece of shit. Irresponsible. If he ever gets into an accident, he won't share like the footage. And he'll probably hurt somebody vehicle, doing that. But right now, this unless is he drives into a ditch, he'll hurt somebody. Income off of, and again, I'm the sole breadwinner in this family, and Carol and I have teamed up together. And Carol does a lot of the behind-the-scenes stuff, like I told you in the last video. So we are a team, and we are in business together, and, and wanting to make this fun. And uh, I keep telling Carol every time we like do a restaurant and we and we eat together and the money that's generated from that video pays for all that food plus our gas and stuff so like the, doing all these adventures and things uh it's just a fun thing so you heard him say he's the sole breadwinner i just don't want to do them anymore i just don't want to do them anymore i just don't want to do them anymore. okay and he said it's a fun thing to do we already heard him get drunk and say he doesn't want to do these things anymore after he said he doesn't want to do them anymore he tried to like retire from a life of retirement which is what it is anyway and take an extra vacation on top of it and he made the channel him and carol fake van lifers he just wanted to drive around and do nothing zero energy even less energy than now. The fans rejected it. They've got money up their butt. Like you can go to the start of this video. That giant property was sold. That's like for anywhere from four to six, seven million dollars. Carol retires immediately after. Ken told us everything. They got all the money that they, they could ever want, and he's doing this as a fucking hobby out of spite because he resents his own fucking audience. That's why he's doing it. He's lying to people. Oh, I need some help. I gotta keep this thing on the road. I'm the sole breadwinner here. People, I need support. It's disgusting. As you saw at the beginning of this video, after the cute shots of ninjas. <laughs> ninja sunning himself you may he have actually noticed. thinks that's Pop grade a footage so i i believe i mean it's like like his his, his what brought him here uh, uh, what do you do you make cat videos and you get a million dollars it's just that easy and we are actually oh uh, people like cute cats look at my cats they're not kittens all right so over the last they're not super days, cute either I've been they're acceptable they're just not and editing they're just like not crazy. super cute uh, i'm actually I and he didn't like even do a tribute dollars. video when that so other cat passed. Will go up, I think, he didn't even do a tribute morning. video when so uh, his dog passed. Two days, I've shot so videos, him playing with uh, the pets actually pisses me off. Because if he's a production company, so then why not do tribute videos for the pets that he had that passed? The cat and the dog. He doesn't. He doesn't give a fuck. They're just props. Just like that van he's driving right now. It's a prop. Like when he pretends that he's a sports fan. It's a prop. He doesn't know anything about the Leafs. He can't talk about them. And like that YouTube pillow in the background. They close the Toronto office and he has to keep leaving it there to remind you. I'm a YouTube celebrity. He isn't. 
So like I said, today is Wednesday. We're all packed. We are headed to my sister's house. She lives close this to the This is airport. terrible babble. So sleeping at their he, house He tonight. just, he just knows one thing. With, Keep uh, talking. My sister, her husband, Anything you mom, can possibly babble for, niece, just babble and, uh, we'll it. And that's content together, if you can. And tomorrow morning we're getting up very early, getting to the airport and flying to Cuba. And I wish we had booked yeah, he's like barely getting by. June, he's he's leaving to go abroad for ten days. That had like that business. He can write some of it point. off if he shoots um, some footage. But because we booked so he late, can't write all of it off. The plane it doesn't have any business class. It just has like regular seating from beginning to end, uh, from the front to the back. Uh, on the way home, we got business class, uh, which will be fun. I'll make a video on the food. In of course, class. Ken Dominic eating anyway, a slice guys, of uh, toast. We get into town, into Alcona and pick up a hue light bulb which is uh, a, a bulb that you can program with your phone through the system note how bad it is right off, once you know what his formula is Christmas which is lights, just talk go on make off, sure you talk when you run the camera put your fucking hands on a fucking wheel you don't care about others uh, this is a character fun. study here uh, at this channel so, uh, i used to have one extra bulb but I use that for our lamp post. So now I gotta get a new one before we go away. Uh, ben is gonna be looking after the cats and uh, living at our house and making sure everything is running smoothly. So no parties. There is no way that Ben is gonna try to have a party in that embarrassing shack in the Elf Village. It's like, yeah, the carpet is uh, older than I am. It's from the 70s. All right, so let's get into town and get that bulb. Hopefully they have them. Our Ken wandering around in a hardware store trying to find something. Jelly smack, go bigger and better. That's very interesting. They actually you like that? I almost talked over my of the Philips fart gag. Two, um, hubs, but they don't sell any bulbs, and I think they're switching over to this new thing called Philips. Wise W I Z Just keep talking. Or Wiz, whatever. And uh oh well. So I'll probably have to go on Amazon to get it. Does everybody get that? He, he can't find today. something here. It's just, it's he might nice have to go to Amazon to get it. Off. You just have it programmed to turn on and off for your outside lights. So we have our like street lamp turn on and off by itself. We don't have to worry about turning it on and off. There have been times in the past where we left it on for like 24 hours by accident. Don't forget to hit the switch before we go to bed. Anyway, thanks for watching. Can't wait to talk to you guys from Cuba. See that you. was a lie. Just like so many other lies from Ken, and I can prove that was a lie. By the way, the reaction is almost over. That's the end of the footage. He says, I can't wait to talk to you guys from Cuba. I'm recording this right now on December 14th. 2023 at 8:30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And yesterday was Wednesday the 13th, 2023, for which Ken Dalek promised to do a live stream. He has all the technology that anyone could need to do a live stream from Cuba, which for his pathetic fans would have been fun for him to do. And he doesn't do it. So what he offers is if you join his channel at a minimum five bucks, and then it, I forget what they all all the different tiers are. It's a minimum five dollars, so you can make comments during his live streams. So people sign up after he does the ask for it, and he says, "Oh, it gets crazy. We have some boiled peanuts sometimes." So people sign up. They they, they give him his money, give him their money to him, and then he doesn't keep up his end of the deal. He doesn't do his live streams regularly. So when he makes his pitch to get the money, he doesn't say, I do them every now and then. He says, every Wednesday. It's crazy, people. So he, he just lied yet again to say, I can't wait to talk to you from Cuba. Bullshit. He's in Cuba. He's already done one boring vlog. And yesterday, he was supposed to do a live stream, and he doesn't do it. So he doesn't want to talk from, them, from Cuba. It's like, thanks for the money, suckers. There you go. So this was... Uh, some work in there and some some uh, freestyle please join the fucking channel 
because I did more work than Ken did just there. $1.99 a month. Custom emoji. Sometimes we do an early release. Okay, get that away. Uh, thanks for coming by. And, uh, done. Is that it? That's it. British penis. <laughs> double, uh, double. That sucked like shit. That sucked huge fucking shit. White Canadian. The Japanese are horrible people. White Canadian. The Japanese are horrible people. White Canadian. The Japanese are horrible people. Tangy.